You may think vanishing testis syndrome is the result of a poorly organised path lab. In fact, it is the disappearance of one or both initially normal testes between the last few months in utero and the onset of puberty. It occurs in around 5% of cases of cryptorchidism and another term for vanishing testis syndrome is testicular regression syndrome or TRS. The condition is now thought to be caused by testicular infarction due to testicular torsion or perinatal scrotal torsion. Scrotal torsion may of course result in both testes vanishing. So, how does vanishing testis syndrome present? Well, it tends to be seen in paediatric pathology and a typical request form may say excision of atrophic testicular remnant from a one-year-old male, for example. Clinically, there is a non-palpable testis with a blind ending spermatic cord situated in the retroperitoneum or inguinal canal and at the end of the cord is a small fibrous nodule, sometimes called a nubbin. The pathological findings are a nubbin of fibrovascular tissue, a rudimentary vas deferens, foci of calcification and also foci of hemosiderin deposition are frequently seen. The epididymis may be present but usually no identifiable seminiferous tubules are seen. This is the typical histological appearance of the fibrovascular nubbin in vanishing testis syndrome. As the name indicates it is composed of the pink fibrous tissue with lots of small blood vessels in it. Here is one of the diagnostic features of vanishing testis syndrome and this is the vast deference that we are zooming into. And in this field you can see the microcalcification composed of tiny irregular purple fragments. And here is a higher power view. Situated just next to the area of microcalcification are these brown staining areas and this is hemosiderin deposition. This section was taken from another example of vanishing testis syndrome and here you can see a lot more golden brown hemosiderin interspersed with the calcification. And it is the presence of hemosiderin that really gives a clue as to why the testis vanished. Hemosiderin is of course the breakdown product of blood and the bleeding is likely to have been caused by the insult that caused the testis to vanish. The insult being hemorrhagic infarction due to torsion causing loss of seminiferous tubules and fibrosis with hemosiderin deposition and calcification.